Based on vibes. We're doing based on vibes. Holy fuck, there's like 800 of them. Uh, they look like a basic demon character. Not a lot of thought went into this design. Putting you in C. Based on vibes, you seem like a basic bitch who tries to be more than what you are. Now we have lady with black hair, but has like orange eyes and like has a couple of scratches on her cheek. Strong jawline. You seem like you'd help me out if I needed it, but I feel like you're also really closed off. So you're going B. Uh, I don't know if I could put you higher. The fuck? I don't know what you are. You look like you're a wannabe Mortal Kombat character. You got your green little mask on. You got the hair. You got the red eye. Oh, a collie. I don't know if you're a girl a or a boy. Ninja. Okay, she's a ninja. Yeah, she got fat ass. She's an assassin. Um, Ari, Ari had like charms you with a little heart and make you fall in love with her and then seduce you and kills you. It's kind of a bitch move, but kind of cool. She's a furry. She's a little fox girl. What? I thought she was a ninja. No, that's that's the the, the girl that you already picked. Oh. When you're picking now, she has an emote where she just eats ramen. Okay, that's pretty based. I was going to put her in C for being a Mortal Kombat wannabe, but eating ramen's base. So we'll put you with other lady because why not? You, I know I don't like you. I don't know what you are. You got fucking strong eyebrows, hair that waves off to the side. Oh, Sean. You're going in D. I don't like you. He has to wear a shirt. Yo, dragon dude looks pretty fucking cool. Purple Rayleigh dragon Soul with the like galaxy dragon. Yeah. Looks pretty that's cool. not a dragon dude. That's a fucking minotaur. Oh, those are horns off the side. I didn't even notice the horns. It looks like just like the face of a dragon coming through smoke. No, that's that's. I mean, either way, you're going in A. Aurelian soul. Okay, this is a Moo Moo. Yeah, Moo Moo. I, a little money, a Moo Moo mummy guy. Love. He's based. He's going crying S. crying mummy who has no friends. Uh, blue ice bird. Ice chicken. Oh, it's a chicken. Anivia, she's All right. a god. That gives you a bonus point for being a chicken instead of a bird. Um, You're better than the two ladies, so we'll put you A. This bitch looks so basic. That's Annie. Oh, That's she's Annie, the one with the fire. Her bear the does there. nothing, so F tier. <laughs> you suck. You've let me down. I hate you. I'm gonna throw my giant mutant bear at them. Waddles to him, does fucking nothing, and dies. Yeah, fuck you. Waste of time. You got something over your eye, and you get that checked out. And on your chin, you look emo and edgy, and I probably would hate sitting next to you at lunch. So you're going D. I'd probably rather hang out with this fucking dickhead over you, low-key. Um, this lady, nothing special about her. She looks bland as hell. Oh, that's Ash. She shoots ice arrows. She can oh, yeah. ice arrows. She shoots ice arrows. So wannabe Elsa from Frozen. So we're putting you... You won't go with these two lunatics. You'll go and see. You're kind of like on the lower end of the stick. But, uh... Aphelios is a mute. Who's the Aphelios person? Uh, the one in D tier that's not uh, Sean. I feel bad that oh. you're a mute. But, uh, buddy, you give me, like... I mean, every mute person that's been in a TV show has been really chill. I'll put you in C just because you seem maybe... Okay, I don't know. Alright, you're a fucking monster of some kind with a little gold helmet thing on and big teeth, a big jaw. That's a alien soul. It's a big galaxy dragon. Alright, that's pretty cool. That's what I thought you were talking about. It's like a, he's a literal dragon, but like he looks like galaxy. And he's like the god of the universe or some shit. So this is what Blep saw himself as when he had the galaxy skin in Fortnite. Yeah. Which should be for Blep's. Galaxy dragon. This guy has a dumbass fucking helmet. That's Azir. He's like an emperor, but he's like a chicken emperor. Aw, oh, dude. You throw in chicken, I gotta raise him up some more. I was gonna put him kind of like he D. He can like summon like guards. He's like Egyptian. Oh, uh, if you would have said summon chickens, he would have gone an A. He summons, some like, guards you can, like, work for him and shit. But he's, like, a king or emperor, but, like, he's a chicken. Okay. You're gonna be in the middle somewhere. If you were a full-on chicken gimmick, I'd love you, but, uh, buddy. But you're an emperor, and emperors are usually assholes, so we're putting you in C. Well, you are chicken. Alright, this is just a fucking ball. That's Bard. He communicates through whistles, and he can create little, little, little cute little guys who are like little bells, and they're really cute. You know he attacks with like a drum thing that creates sound waves or something. He's going know. top of A because he looks like a bowling ball, and that's funny. He's really round and fat. 
Uh, um, you're. That's Belveth. It's like a stingray thing that like, but like floats straight up and down. Okay, so that has that, a crush that's on not her. Actually, that's not actually its head. That's just like it's like it tries to lure you in with that. But its actual head is like super ugly and gross, and it's like a big like monstrous teeth thing. So she's a and catfish. Like, like a, yeah, it's a catfish. Wow. Thing. Test, test. F for not and, uh, being cool. It's like a stingray thing. I'll put Teddy Bear Lady up above. She doesn't deserve to be an next catfish, but she is useless. All right, this is the fucking robot. That's a Blitzcrank. He yeah, looks funny. Robot with the big giant arms and the tiny ass legs. I'll, I'll give him A. So far, no one's touched a Moo Moo. That sounds weird. This guy is a fire guy. This is the prisoner, the secret skin That's from brand. Fortnite. It, they look the exact same. Yeah. You're going in D for ripping off Fortnite. Uh, this giant. Guy was created first. He was don't pregnant. care. Don't care. You're the dad from Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs, or Doctor Robotnik. Wrong. He doesn't wear a shirt, and he's big and muscular, and he carries a big giant shield and protects people. <sighs> All right, you care about your homies. That's respectable. But uh, you're just like the dad from Cloudy with a Chance. Be original. You're going B. You could be a little higher. All right, you have a cool hat, lady. That's Caitlyn. She's a lesbian, and she has a like a rifle and like can snipe people but she's a lesbian all right 10 points for being a lesbian i like your hat you're going a uh okay basic bitch number like five you have like glowing eyes and Camille. white hair she has knife legs and is an old general lady who is kind of like a robot lady with scissor with like 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 knife scissor legs she seems really boring to hang out with, but you got me with knife legs. That sounds cool. She'll she won't go enough. All right, again, another that's basic Cassio lady. That's Cassiopeia. She's basically like Medusa. Could you be more She's original? Just Medusa, like snake body, woman, like torso and uppers, and like it's like just like snake woman Medusa. Yeah, she needs to be more original. And Medusa's mean, so we're gonna put you in F. Fiddlesticks, my goat. You're going an S. That's not Fiddlesticks. What? Shogath. Where's Fiddlesticks? Is he the big he's mouth big guy right here? Monster. Yeah, he's the big mouth. Ah, uh, fuck. Everybody. I thought he reminded that's, me of that's, Fiddle. That's Shogath. Yeah, yeah, the one you had. Yeah, that's Fiddlesticks. Okay. And, yeah. Fiddlesticks is my goat. He's going an S, even though I don't remember what he looks like. This big monster guy, who I thought was Fiddlesticks, he, lied he to gets, me. He, he's a big monster and grows bigger and bigger and bigger as the game goes on. He can be so big, he takes up the entire screen. Alright, that seems base so as big, hell, but knowing League, it's probably cool useless. Uh, it's actually pretty bad, because then you can get hit by a lot more. <sighs> but he gains more HP. He can, like, eat people. Like, actually eat people. And, like, just kill them by eating them. But he's, like, a big giant monster thing. We'll keep him B. We'll put him next to the other monster, the Galaxy he's pretty Boy. Cool, honestly. This guy looks kind of silly. Dr. Eggman with the helmet. Oh, that's Corgi. He's a little dwarf midget who flies a little airplane. And that's basically all, that's basically his shtick. He's like a pilot little airplane midget. Kind of bland, but he looks funny. He won't go in F. We'll go top of D. This guy looks like a just just a fucking normal white dude. What? Kind of is. That's Darius. He, uh, he has a big giant axe. Like a massive fucking axe. And he's just like a normal guy with a big giant axe. Bottom of that, armor. you're not creative in a world full of, like, magical fucks, alright. Uh, you got something on your head, glowing lady. That's Diana, she has some, Princess like, a Diana. thing. And she's, like, queen of, like, the night people or whatever. And she's also a lesbian. Alright, again, ten points for lesbian, but she doesn't have a cool hat, so it'll be... Uh, this guy looks all sorts of funky. Looks like a Dr. zombie. Mundo. He, uh, is, like, a crazy doctor guy who's, like, dead... And has a big giant like cleaver, and he's just he's like a big dumb monster doctor. I like what I'm hearing. He's not S worthy, but I'll put him top of A. This guy again, another base. He looks like a mad. That's Draven. This is Tyler One. Yeah, it's Tyler One. Have you ever seen Tyler One? I yeah, recognize Tyler the Tyler One, one profile he, picture. He like, throws these like little like twirly like sword things at people, and he has to like, and he's like super self centered, arrogant, and like. Self-absorbed. So best six five two five in game. No, Tyler one. Tyler one. Um. I Me mean, again. You kind of look basic, and apparently you're an asshole. So you're going F. Sorry, Tyler one. Pro I'll give you a D because at least you're Tyler one. All right, this is just a kid. That is just a kid. His name's Echo. He's black. 
and he can he kind of can like stop and go back in time a little bit uh he has a sword thing and he uh basically can just kind of like go back in time and he i don't know if you you saw arcane, arcane right i made you watch it nope you never did okay well he's he's an arcane and he was a little young kid that grew up but his name's echo and he can he's just kind of like so time he's, related he's named after an amazon product that's kind of lame but okay. i'll put you c because the time stuff is cool uh red lady looks that's like she'd be a marvel she villain shape shift into a spider that's pretty cool especially a spider woman but the mcu already has black widow so sorry you didn't make the cut but you'll go see another lady that could be a fairy that's of some kind sex, she's the sex demon or like lust demon where she like flirts with everyone no matter what you look like or who you are she like flirts with you and she can go invisible and like she like seduces you with her body oh my <laughs> um uh i don't know, I mean, I don't know. she's like a demon um you know using sex as a weapon is really not cool man so we're gonna put you more of just lust it's more lust than sex more just like lust you're better than Catfish Lady, and she's an F, so I'll put you D. Alright, this is Zelda. That's Ezreal. He's like an explorer guy who could shoot, like, magic balls out of his arms. Oh, hell yeah, balls. And he kind of just goes around collecting artifacts from wedding and shit. Like so he's like Link, stuff. not Zelda. I guess, yeah. Or a mix of both. Their child. Link and Zelda's child is this guy. It's Ezreal. Yeah, Azrael. He has a crush on Lux. Lux isn't on here yet? Uh, no, she's further down. She's like a little wizard girl. Okay, this is... That's Farah. From Fortnite. Farah, or not... And Overwatch. That's Fiora, that's Fiora. Oh. Fiora's like a fence, she like deals with like, she's like a fencing... Oh, lame. ...warrior lady who's like a soldier, but like, she like does all her shit with like fencing and she's French. Uh -huh, F tier for French. All right, this blue little alien guy looks cool. That's Fizz. He's like a little water. Fizz is dope as hell. Thing. He's dope as hell. And he's short as fuck. I don't he's know who Yumi it. is, but I'll I'll come to Yumi. Sure. Yumi's a cat who rides a book who's a little shit. Oh my god, if it's who I'm thinking, because I was looking at this little dude right here. This guy is definitely going S tier. Whoever this is, That's right? Here. I'm sure you're looking at Heimerdinger. Yeah, that's Heimerdinger. All right, that's you're a going really S. smart little midget. We're putting you S already, He's buddy. a really smart midget. He's like Einstein, but he's like a midget, and he's like a yordle. God, there's so many more. Fuck. <laughs> oh, fuck. I gotta, I gotta add. Oh, fuck. All right, so it's a white knight. Gold yeah, it's helmet. Galio. He's like a statue come to life, and he like protects against magic. And he's just like a big giant statue who like just protects people. It's pretty cool. I guess magic. I'll put him that's B. Like his purpose. I think I'll put him B. I think B's solid. Then after that's Gangplank. The pirate dude. He's like a swashbuckler, like pirate guy who eats oranges. Okay, not not cool. And he has barrels. He shoots barrels. That's dope and then as barrels hell. Barrels explode people. That's dope as hell. You had me until you said oranges. Oranges are nasty. You're going F. I'm kidding. You'll stay at A. Alright, again, another basic white dude. Darren is the exact same as Darius, only instead of an axe, he just has a big giant sword. All right. And he's blue. Axe is at least somewhat different. Fuck you, Aaron. Idiot. Darren. Darren, idiot. Alright, this Darren. little cat. That's, that, uh, that's, that's fucking, that's Nar. Nar is a cute little fucker who throws, like, little club boomerang things at you. Then he turns into this big giant monster guy who, like, freaking, like, can demolish you. Like, he turns he turns from a cute little shitter to, like, a big, giant, little, gnarly monster. Mm hmm As he, like, really gains rage and shit. So it's like the other dude that grows bigger and bigger. No, but this one, like, transforms into something different. Oh. Uh... He, he goes from cute and then, like, transforms into, like, a big, giant monster. So he's better than the dragon guy that gets big. Yeah, that one just, it's the same the guy, he just gets bigger, 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 and bigger. This guy has evolution. I'll put you atop a B with the uh, Eternal Dragon or whatever the hell. Alright, this dude soul. is actually that's, Dr. That's Eggman. Gra that's Gragas. He's a big drunk. 
with no shirt and ba like barely like wears a cloth around his balls. So All right. Show. Bleps is in League of Legends. That's cool. He carries a big giant barrel that has booze in it, and he <sighs> has an ability where he burps every time he use it. Okay. He's burp, a big giant drunk. Burp humor is not funny, but then again, only eight year olds play League of Legends, so. The barrel thing, we already He's had that with the pirate. Fat guy and holds a barrel in his hands. Like a giant barrel as big as his fucking stomach, and he's fucking huge. Pirate guy did it way better. You, you're like losing two ranks because of that guy. You'll go, uh, you'll go C only because you remind me of Blubs. This is Doctor Strange. That's Gra Graves. He's gay, and he has a giant shotgun thing that he uses, and he's like a swashbuckler as well. But okay. He's gay. So a gay pirate. A gay pirate with a big giant shotgun. All right, this will definitely be Lil Nas X's new character when he releases a new album. No, that's going to be Cassante. He's a gay guy as well, but he's like... I don't know how to say, like, African. Like, inspired, <laughs> I, knew, I knew it. Inspired. I knew you were going to say something. Like, inspired-wise, like, like, the lore behind it is, like, behind, like that. And he, like, I, I, I thought... has two giant, like, things that turn into two giant, like, cleaver swords, and they're really cool. <laughs> when Cassante's you... cool as fuck. You're like, but he's, uh, when you like to that pause, like, alright, he's thinking about how to say this. Cassante is literally Little Nas X. If Little Nas X was big, buff, and, like, had giant things in his hands where he could beat people up with them. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. Um, not as cool as other pirate barrel guys. You're going to see. Alright, blue hair, yeah. little Twitch streamer. Man, fuck him. She was a doll turned into a human... And she has scissors, big giant scissors, That's which is like cool. a doll turned into like human. All right, sounds like something out of a horror movie. That'd be cool. She has giant ass fucking scissors. Freddy Krueger meets Annabelle. That'd be awesome. Um, or Chucky, I guess, would make more sense. Kinda, well, yeah, actually. Uh, B for creativity. Okay, this guy is. Ekrum is a big fucking... giant mit like I don't even want to say minute minotaur. What? Uh, what's the what's the horse man? Minotaur. Then what's a what's a bull man? I don't know. He's he's like a giant ghost horse man hybrid thing. Oh, centaur! Centaur's the horse. Oh, I don't know, but it's a horse that like has a big giant like staff sword thingy that is like a ghost horse, and he's really fucking cool. I'll and he can him... run really really fast. B, I think B seems okay. I'll put him above dead. statue man. Oh, he's dead. Damn, sucks. All right, this lady Alari. seems crazy. She got eyes. She, uh, she attacks with tentacles. She's a big tentacle mommy. Okay, I bet there's a lot of porn of her on the internet. Um, she's well, she's big buff dummy mommy, but like, then like big and muscular, but uh, attacks with tentacles and shit. A lot of porn. A lot of porn of her. Guarantee it. I, I uh, not really. She's not really appealing to the eyes. But wow. Okay. She does do tentacles. There is not a lot. Oh. Damn, Star. I don't I don't like that you know that. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, there's a lot of the next character you're choosing. I'm sure there is. There's I really probably some of every fucking character. I'm she holds... Wrong. She can, like, make... She has, like, floating swords around her, and she can, like, zip to people, and she, like, uses the floating swords to attack. She seems basic as fuck. She's going F. Alright, woodland creature man. Or like That's a Sasquatch. A big, he's, just a big giant, he's just a big giant tree, ma like old man who like is at peace with nature, and just kind of like he's like super supportive. He like doesn't really attack much. He doesn't do a lot of damage or nothing, but he's like a big giant supporter guy who's like at one with nature and like is p super peaceful and passive in nature. But he's a big giant tree guy. So man. he's Groot like, from old. Guardians of the Galaxy. Kind of. He was nice. old and super passive. Alright, yeah, I'll put him A. He seems dope. Alright, uh... He's like Gandhi Groot. Jinx has the most for league characters. I would assume so. She's like the poster child for the game. We'll go to uh, Jinx. Jan... Oh, okay, we'll go to Jinx. Yeah, Jinx, Jinx seems really chill. No, Jinx. She's like crazy. Yeah. And has like two guns, like a giant rocket blaster, and then a little fucking minigun. So basically Harley Quinn, if she had she's, weapons. She's basically... She is Harley Quinn in League of Legends. Crazy, mental, and all like all that shit. Jinx seems cool for the most part. We'll move on to Elsa from Frozen Part 2. That's Janna. She's like a wind goddess lady who wears a bikini and is hot as fuck. And uh, she like could cr create tornadoes. And she f 
like can fly, and she's like goddess of the wind or some shit. Jenna's cool as fuck. She can like cr- literally create tornadoes. Bottom of B tier. I'll put you above Green Ninja Lady. Uh, again, another dude wearing a helmet. That's Jarvin the Fourth. He's like the king of a place, and he has basically just a giant spear. He attacks you with a big giant spear. Lame. You're going F. Yeah, he is kind of lame. Omen from Valorant. That's Jax. He had to be nerfed so st- because he's so powerful, he attacks you with a light pole. I'm not kidding. It's literally a light pole. D tier for being a Valorant character and Valorant sucks. Um, it's a, it's white a dude, again, F tier. That's, that's, uh, that's Jace. He can switch weapons from a big giant hammer to like a little blaster hand. Like, well, it's like he crit and this hammer like opens up and becomes a blaster. That and seems he can cool. like attack you with a big giant, like a giant fucking hammer that can turn into basically a gun. All right, I'll put you under Teddy Bear Lady then. That sounds pretty cool. Oh actually. yeah, Jax does have a voice line for Ma- a Make-A-Wish kid. Oh, there you go. See? That's the one that looks like Omen. Props for... Oh, oh fuck. Lamp pole. Damn. Doesn't make a wish. Ah, oh, fuck. But you do look like a Valorant And he has character. a skin for a Make-A-Wish kid as well. Does the good outweigh the bad in this situation? Make-A-Wish is really cool, but Valorant really sucks. Leaving you bottom of deer. You're not F, so that's good enough. All right. This guy. That's Jin. He's an assassin. He's like an artist assassination. He, like... Kills people like with like the intent of creating art. He's like obsessed with the number four, and he shoots like a gun that go like the last bullet. So like bullet number four does a fuck ton of damage, and he like loves flowers and art, and he's like an assassin. He, like kills people for the purpose of like getting like fulfillment through like death being an art form, kind of. Okay, I could rock with that. Design is very basic, but his little thing, his gimmick's cool, I guess. Uh, he'll go bottom of C. I'm gonna shrink my camera a little bit, or like move it all the way in this like corner where you see my head. Uh, yeah, that should be fine. Yeah, Jen kills people for art, and he has cool ass voice on that is true. Jen, I think, is my favorite character thematically and like within the lore and shit all right we got oh wait let me chat oh yeah then he has... yeah Huey is another character who's also an artist i don't know where to put he attacks chat. you with magical paint art shit with his paintbrush i don't, I don't think he's to on here put it's you. too new Uh, I'll put it over here. All right. Um, this Next lady, one is Kaisa. So basically, you remember that monster I said that gets bigger, 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 and bigger. Yes. I imagine her getting fused with like creatures like that, and then all of a sudden she's like becomes she's like a human that becomes one of them, who like can go like invisible, shoot like laser blasts, and like becomes the mo- like a monster human fusion because of like she had to go it's called the void but everything that goes to the void either dies or becomes a monster so she's like a purple she's she's her, her, it's like she's like spider-man she's like you know how spider-man got bit by a thing and then got turned turned into spider-man mm-hmm. like she's like spider-man kind of but like not really but that's like the bestest like comparison i have Kaisa has a dad. Uh oh, damn, we'll F tier then. Oh. Uh, I mean, she looks hella basic, though. Like She's a dumpy, bro. I hope you know I'm, I'm thinking about uploading this to YouTube, so... Oh. Uh, this is how you're gonna live forever. <laughs> oh, no! Yeah, I probably should mention that earlier, but, uh... Mm. Half of me are like, she's hot as fuck. She's got a big dumper. Uh, I like Kaisa. She looks really basic, though. She looks angry. Very yeah, angry. Stuck in a void. All right, I'll put you bottom portion of C tier. All right, this is uh, what you call it? Avatar, way of water. That that that's fucking uh uh. I mean, this is a K. K. 
Callista. Yeah, Callista. she's dead. She's like she's a dead, dead lady who attacks with spears. And she's like, uh, like yeah, she's like dead. She's like Hecarim. Like, remember that horse guy I was saying was dead, but is really cool? Yeah. She's, they're like the same thing. Like, they're both dead, but she attacks with... She like throws spears at you that like stick on you. And then she can like pull them out of you and kills you. Like, they're all just stuck. Like, she throws spears at you. They're all stuck inside you. And then she can just like... Take them all out at once and does a fuck ton of damage and kills you. She throws like spirit spears at you or something. Top shit. of C. I can't just by putting her in B. Oh yeah. Why are there so many like basic looking people, bro? Come on now. This lady has an emerald on her forehead. She makes the enemy a pin cushion. That is exactly right. Karma. Karma, she's like a Karma fucking... is my boyfriend. She's Karma's like, imagine gone. someone who does fucking yoga and that shit and is like is one with their chi or whatever the fuck and then she can like she does like magic and shit 10 points for yoga 10 points for being named after a taylor swift song but it's not gonna take you that high i like her vibe although she is somewhat basic i'll put her bottom of b this guy is taking up the whole profile picture, and he's like a ghost knight or something. Yeah, that guy's also like the one I said that spears and the horse guy. He's dead, and he like is like a has a book and does spells from his book, and then he can like die, and then, but he could still like attack you and shit when he's dead. What you above, old lady? He's like an old undead wizard who doesn't ever die there's so, so many more all right cassidy this guy is remember the one i said got fused with that like the void or whatever mm -hmm. this is this is her dad who was a normal guy but went to the void to go look for his daughter and then got turned into this thing and he can like teleport and shit and he got turned into like this void thing who has like this like dagger but like imagine a big dagger that's like a attached to his hand but it's like a big dagger in like in the form of a sword like an energy sword kind of but yeah he got turned into that trying to find his daughter he looks pretty cool yeah he is pretty cool actually. he looks like a triceratop i'll put him b all right red haired lady she's an assassin lady who could throw knives at you and then teleport to her knives and but yeah, she's like assassin lady with red hair. Her name's Katarina, and she's really cool. Um, top of D. She's dating the guy that I said was just a big guy with a sword. She's in love with Green. Garen. Oh, Garen. I thought. Fuck. All right, this guy. She's like an angel. Her name's Kale, and oh, she like gets woman? stronger and she, yes, and she gets stronger and stronger and stronger as the game goes on. She's really fucking weak at the beginning, but all of a sudden she's just like a fucking because she's an angel. She's basically turned into a god by the end of it. But she has like a god complex where she thinks no one's like as good as her, or she doesn't. Damn. She thinks like people who aren't angels or gods like are not not like as good as her. She e is. tier. Terrible attitude. All right, this guy looks stupid. Or that's Kane. He's an assassin as well. So many but assassins. He has this big giant scythe, which is a darken, which is basically means it's like a demon trapped inside of a scythe, which could either take over Kane's body and like kill him, and take over his body, and he turns into a big giant demon with a scythe that can like teleport through walls, or Kane can like kill the demon and take over the scythe and he turn into this big giant fucking anime man with long hair and like I don't know no shirt on and like fly through walls and like kill people really fast and just assassinate him in the lickety split damn he seemed basic but then you brought up the uh thing where he I forgot fuck he can either oh or like the sword kills weapon, him yeah and then he gets turned into a demon or he kills the demon within the scythe and gets like a super cool scythe that's like, cool tight. that that but... saves him from being f he'll go in d what the fuck? well you also brought up he turns into a big anime man and that's lame uh 
This guy has a hood. He's part of the Illuminati, probably. Do you know what, like, the big, the big fucker in S tier, the big Heimerdinger with the goggles? Yeah. He's the same thing as him, only he's like an electro rat ninja thing. It's pretty cool. Not as cool as this guy. Oh, he's here. A, yeah, he's like he's kind of like a squirrel. <laughs> but he's like a like a ninja squirrel that throws ninja stars, electric ninja stars. Hell yeah, I'd put him in B, but after that description, he goes in A. Alright, we got the Green Goblin, but inverted color edition. That's he's like a he's like a fucking bug that evolves as he kills things. He's also an assassin who kills things and like can take off. How many like, assassins are in League of Legends? I'd, like grow and adapt and get stronger and like. He's like a bug, but like a bug that evolves. Evolving bug assassin. I don't like bugs, and there's too many assassins. We'll go and see. Alright, this guy is just a mask. This is this it's, is it's dream. A, it's a lamb. It's a lamb. Oh. It's a lamb and a wolf. And basically it's the incarnation of death. like you know like death, like death with a scythe. Mm -hmm. It's like they're come they come to you. This is basically that. Norm MacDonald from the Family game. Guy. It's basically that. It's, it's a lamb and a wolf. The lamb shoots like <laughs> bows and arrows and shit. And the, the lamb has that, like, that mask on. Inside of you, there are two wolves. One's an actual wolf, and one's like, a lamb. A, it's a wolf, but it's just, like, the head of the wolf that, like, floats around and shit that, you know, like, can, like, just bite you and eat you, basically. And basically, if you see it, like, you're dead. So death with the scythe walking around, but if he was a instead wolf, of the, sheep. Instead, it, it was sex if it was a sheep with a bow and arrow and a big giant wolf spirit head that will, follows it around. All right. B tier so yeah. in memory of Norm Macdonald. All right, this is a fucking warrior cat. That's Kled. He's basically imagine like that Heimerdinger at S tier with mm -hmm. the big goggle thing, like that thing, but it's riding a big giant lizard, and he's like a dumb fucker who's like, like imagine like a country voice, but like as a like a little guy who thinks he's a general. Okay. Of, but he's a general of no one except for himself, and he has a big giant lizard thing. Oh, Kled has PTSD. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. He's just like a fucking crazy lunatic riding a big giant fucking, like, lizard dinosaur raptor thing. I was gonna put him a tear under a goggles guy, but you say he's riding a lizard? Fuck yeah, that's S. He's S. Alright, this dude's a fucking arachnid or something, probably. That's Kogma. It's like a big monster thing that has, like, an artillery gun that has, like, vomit it shoots out of its mouth. Ew, I don't like, like vomit. vomit. acid it shoots out of its mouth. It's Reminds like me of Plague gun. from Dead by Daylight. She sucks, or he goes C. <laughs> really similar. All right, uh, this lady reminds me She's of like the other wizard. lady that has She's a like gem. like a like a magician. Like now you see me, now you don't type shit. Oh, that movie's pretty good. I haven't seen it. And she can she just kind of like can appear and disappear and shit. And she's like a magician, I think, or some shit. Who kinda owns lame. like she's like runs like a fucking what is it called? An underground fucking mob. Oh, shit. like the mafia. Like a mafia type shit, yeah. She's a mob boss? Kinda, yeah, basically. Mob boss magician. Under Teddy Bear Girl. Our blind dude. Bandana over his eyes. He's like a... Uh... Is it ninja? I don't... It's not ninja. It's like a... Uh, <laughs> An assassin? What, what is, mixed martial... A martial artist who's oh. blind. Okay. And he can like... Kick your ass, even though he's blind. He's a karate movie. He's so he's like Daredevil. Ever, but he's blind. It's Daredevil. He's like if Jackie Chan was blind. All right. And not Asian. He might be Asian. I don't know. I, never, I don't play him. He's too difficult to play. Uh, C. Fuck it. I don't know. He doesn't appeal. C for being blind. No, it's not because he's blind. Alright, um... This is Leona. Celine Dion. She's, she's a lesbian as well, but she's a lesbian of the sun. Basically, remember that Diana lady I said was a lesbian? Yeah. the moon? She's like lesbian, but for the sun. So they're like, they're lesbians together. Is the and lesbian of the moon the one with giant, the hat? The lesbian is one with the big giant like circle on her forehead. Ah, damn. I, I Not lesbian with hat, lady, so I'm not as big of a fan. She's the one with the circle on it, and she has a big giant gold armor and a big giant shield and a big giant fucking sword, and she like protects like the sun people or whatever. Damon. Ah. Her and Diana are basically I'll put her like next lovers. to Moon Lover, fucking Moon Knight. All right, we have E Girl Twitch streamer probably. That's Lilia. She's a deer. Um, what? She gains movement speed when she hits you with her shits. 
and she can put you to sleep with like that's like her stick she puts you to sleep she's like a like she's like with a like a horse man but it's like she's a deer girl she's a deer yeah she's a deer never would have picked she up has a little what do, you, what do you call it like a whip it's not a whip it's like a stick with a rock on the end of it and she hits you with a rock it's like a cat toy i guess kind of <laughs> All right, we'll put you next to the wolf lamb thing. All right, blue lady that looks like she's made out of stone. Uh, that's Lysandra, and she's instead of stone, it's ice. Mm. She can like entrap herself in a bunch of ice, and then it like can explode and shit. It's actually kind of cool. She could throw out a big giant claw and then teleport to the end of the claw. She Lysandra. looks really basic, but that power sounds ice cool. So basically, top of she's D. Elsa. If Elsa was really fucking evil, Elsa does turn a bit evil and frozen. But she just wants to protect her sister. Okay, anyway. Uh, this guy is Lucian. He's big. basically like a sentinel of light. Okay. Uh, he has two twin guns that can shoot really fast. Like, they're like kind of like pistols, but not quite pistols. They're made of like stone or whatnot. And he's he, his lover's Soda, who's basically him with a big giant like gun who can snipe people from really long away, basically. He was the first black character in the game representation and they gave him two twin guns and he can dash and shit and he like fights off like demons and evil and like stuff like that was, i'll put him above cool. fat dude no under under fat dude with the barrel belly all right we got this little girl she's a She's I don't know. Uh, that's Lulu. She's like like Heimerding or short little shitter who fucking has a little pixie around her, and she's annoying as fuck. C tier. Yeah, she's blonde like, lady. In the ass. Just uh, blonde lady. That's Lux. That's the girl I was telling you that Ezreal was in love with, and she's like a witch, but like a good witch kind. Of, like you know what I'm saying? Like wizard yes. witch. Who, like she deals with like light and stuff like like light magic and she can like do a big giant fucking laser beam. After yeah. this, I should do like a quiz. Like I get every character and I have to like say what who they are, a personality trait, and what their power is, and I gotta like be graded on it. She's uh, a human mage that isn't in prison in Demacia. That's true. She's a human, she's so she's royalty. lame. D only because I don't think she'll be as she seems nice, low key. You go see. You seem nice above the little kid. All right, this guy is a big oh, dragon with green eyes and mouth. That's Malphi. He's a big giant mountain. He's a mountain. He's a big giant mountain that can move and beat ass. All right, I like that. A hey, doesn't take a whole lot to impress me. I mean, maybe they're maybe. Maybe, yeah, okay. Uh, this guy is a Pokemon, for sure. That's Malzahar? He, you remember how I said Cassidy and went to go find his daughter? Yes. This guy went in just because he felt like it, and he's evil, and Damn. basically kind of the same thing happened to him that happened to Cassidy, only this guy's evil. Alright, kind and of base. more, like, and he's more wizardy. Badass. Guy. He goes in B. He went in there just for funsies. What a goat. Alright, this fucking guy. I don't That's even know. That's Maokai. He's like a big giant tree. Okay. Guardian guy who can like create and summon little seedling tree guys. Okay. And he can like create a big giant like tree wave tsunami thing that can like hold you in place. Put him next to old tree guy. That sounds awesome. He he's cooking. What the fuck is this? Oh, I thought that was just like all eyeballs for a second. This guy has a cool well, goatee. He's like a samurai who can like beat your ass with a big giant fucking sword. All right, kind of on the basic side, but his look is interesting. So he'll go somewhere in the middle, probably top he's, of C. He's skinny as fuck. For the hells of it, top of C. He's all basically right, this sword is, man ninja samurai. This is uh, she's a Russian spy, hundred percent. That's misfortune. She's like a swashbuckler as well. Oh what? Uh, she has two guns that are like flintlock pistols, kind of. She can run really fast. She can shoot her guns like a lot. Bah, 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 kind of hard with her ult. Uh, she has big titties, and that's basically her whole character trait. 
She seems she's cooler a, than the other pirate, pirate guy. With two flintlocks and big tits. She doesn't sound as cool as the first pirate guy. Better than fat pirate guy. Oh wait, no, Doctor Strange was the pirate guy. I'll put her B. She's like in the middle. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, this is the knight from Fortnite. One hundred percent. That's Mordekaiser. He's also dead, but he like traps souls. Mordekaiser he's like the, and Rigby. he's like he he's like he Hecrome. He's like uh Callista. He's like dead, but he was like a big warrior guy who finally died, and then he was too strong to like get his soul trap or whatever so he became like a general for the undead so he's just kind of like a big giant metal thing man thing with a big giant mallet hammer that's really sharp uh, or something like that I don't know he's really fucking massive black metal and ghost and shit I think over time he'd definitely grow on me but for now I'm just not feeling him I like his name Mordekaiser, Mordekaiser and Rigby Put him in C for now, but I feel like he can move up to a B. If I feel like it. Uh, this lady has purple eyes. She's Reyna from Valorant. And That's she might Morgana. be an elf. She's she's the opposite of what Kale was. Who's Kale she again? Thought, uh, the one that thought gods and angels are superior or oh, whatever. And if you're not that, you're basically trash. Yeah, this she lady. thought the opposite, and she got rid of her like angel status, which is why she's purple and shit. And she's like the opposite of that. She so can, she's like, a good throw... guy. Yeah, she's. It's like the rules, like what they look like, and they're the opposite. She's basically like for hu like human think humans deserve to exist, and like they shouldn't just be damned for not being as good as gods and angels or whatever. Uh, so her wings don't work. She can't fly. I'll put her next to pirate lady. Uh, yeah, she her basic whole thing is locked down. Keep you in one spot, and then everyone it down. Else just destroy the fuck out of you. God damn, there's still so many. All right, speed fire. Let's go, green lady. That's Nami. She's like a fish woman <laughs> thing who throws bubbles at you. That's and awesome. Heal, and heals her teammates. Okay, base. I'm putting her A. Next, uh, a pharaoh Egyptian dog thing. Ooh, Egyptian dog. I don't know. He looks oh, but, like oh, Nasus. Yeah, he's, bro. He's, yeah, he's like the Egyptian god guy. Yeah, I know what I'm name. talking about. Yeah, he gains stacks of shit till he can one shot you with his big giant uh, fucking like, axe hammer thing. One shotters in video games That's ruin cool. games, and they should all fuck off. So he's going D. Well, yeah, but it takes him a long ass time to like farm up and uh, get stacks of them. Fuck him. Uh, big oh, robot golem. A big giant, imagine a big giant submarine man with a big giant hook who could just like stop you in your tracks. He's a big giant like submarine guy from underwater that can just throw his hooks on at you submarine guy you had me at big giant submarine not gonna lie i would say a but i'm feeling a b pharaoh dog can move up because i do like the look of him uh another girl who probably works at hot topic <laughs> what the heck oh that's nico she's like a lizard like chameleon girl mm -hmm. who can just like that's basically her stick. She's like a chameleon girl. That's can, dope. Like, transform into other characters. That's basically. dope as hell. Among Us, kind of, not really. But based, no, she quite literally is like shapeshifter in Among Us. That's awesome. You're going A for she Among Us. Oh, she can turn into fucking anything and everything. Actually, yeah, put you above Green Lady. All right, uh, some kind of girl with teeth around her neck. Guarantee she's Australian. Oh, that's Nidalee. She can turn into like a fucking like jaguar lion. Thing is she Australian? And no, I don't think so. No, okay. and she can throw a big giant spear at you that fucks you up. Big giant so then boomerang. She can turn into like a oh a cougar. She can turn into a fucking cougar. Oh, she's Jaguar, in the younger cougar men. Cat thing. If she was Australian, I put her B. But since she's not, I'm let down and disappointed. C. All right, lady who also could work at Hot Topic, but she's more of a Spencer's gal in my That's eyes. That's Neela. She's like what? What is she? Something of the. I don't know. She she has some fucking thing where she's always alone or something. All right, emo. She, like she's doomed to be alone or something. Like, Hella oh no, emo. she's she's doomed to be happy for all her life as like a curse. Oh. And she uses like a water whip to like attack you. And she can yeah, that's basically her stick. She's she whips cursed to be happy whip, all her and life. And she's cursed to be happy because she did something she wasn't supposed to or something. So like she that. wants to be sad, but they're like, nah, bitch, you're happy. She can't be any. She cannot not be happy. She's like cursed to always being happy or something. I'd like probably that. hate to hang out with her. She'd probably be so positive. I'd be like, okay, okay, okay. I'll put her C. Uh, this is Mewtwo. 
obviously. You too. Yeah, the same. Oh, that's Nocturne. He's like a demon thing that like has little fucking razor hands. Okay. Attacks you with his razor hands. Freddy Krueger. Like sword razor hands or whatever. And he can like turn the whole map dark so nobody can see. And then he like flies to his target and just like starts fucking whacking at him with his razor hands. That's fucking badass. Borderline S tier. I'm giving. I'm, I'm telling you. Uh, top of A, that sounds really dope. He's basically a reincarnation of Freddy Krueger. Fuck yeah. Of Legends. This is the child from Ice Age. All grown well, that's up. That's Nudu and Willop. He's a big giant, like, uh, uh, fucking, like, that fucking snow monster or whatever. Big giant white snow monster. Abominable snowman. Yeah, and then a little fucking kid that rides on him because he befriended the abominable snowman. Okay. He can make a giant fucking snowball, which he can roll across the entire map, and it can just fucking, like, knock you up and fucking roll your shit over with a big giant fucking snowball that sounds awesome maybe a but i don't know feeling like a, a like a mid b kind of situation put him above the lesbian moon and sun ladies this is a viking boring but let's hear let's hear him out a viking this guy that's olaf basically the, I'm frozen. The, the more the more damage he gets like the stronger and faster he can like attack you and life steal from you he's basically literally just a viking but uh, his whole shtick is he gets stronger the closer he is to death. All right, I like He's that. <laughs> angry guy who can't get stunned. Okay, kind of based. Um, I was feeling low B, but maybe keep him in high C, top of C for now. Uh, this lady is definitely a robot or a scientist. One of the two. Yeah, she's like a robot who like is clockwork related and shit. Um, uh, and I gotta take a piss. Yeah, he's taking a piss. Um, <sighs> clockwork related in a robot lady. I don't know. Seems kind of mid. I'm gonna put her top of D. All right, this guy is like, he's got a nice looking mustache. Star, I know you're on a delay because you're a chatter right now. Oriana, she throws balls around. I'm assuming that's the lady I just put in. Uh, D. Oh, Orn. He's a god of crafting, hell yeah, Minecrafter. And the forge, okay. He looks cool. Crafting thing seems cool. I think it may be like low A, high B. Uh, uh, top of A, or no, top of B, I mean. Rom's shield is his door, okay. This guy is another knight. He doesn't look as cool as the other knights I've seen, so I don't know. Might be a little rough on him, but I just, you know, he doesn't look... He doesn't look special. Doesn't look too special. Not gonna lie. Pantheon, he's one of the beginner guys that best want me to play, so I don't like him. He's a guy that fights gods, that sounds pretty cool. But like, I don't know, he doesn't look cool. He doesn't look the part. He looks like he fights, like, dungeon gremlins, not gods. Ugh. Um. Ah, uh, you're gonna go top it. No, not. You're not as cool as, like, Lady here. Super strong. Put you under Teddy Bear Girl. Okay, please. Please, I'm begging you. Okay, uh child with purple eyes and she looks really sad whoever it is <laughs> uh poppy all right the singer or the playtime she's a tank yordle she's a tank does that mean she's short but is she like big since she's a tank or does that like not have a connection <laughs> she's short this person seems like they get on my nerves, that's for sure. No? Damn. Uh, I don't know. I feel like I would not get along with this person. I don't know. I get that vibe. She has armor. Oh. It makes it so people can't dash. Okay. Kind of cool. But, uh, I don't know. I'm not digging. I'm not digging the vibe. Bottom of D. We got, like, four rows left. Alright, this dude looks like he's breathing under water or something. He's got a helmet on with like a mask or something. That's kind of cool. He has a decent little look to him. Pikey? 
Pikey. Or Pike, I don't know. He drowned? Seems like it. I don't know why I keep rocking my chair. And now he drowns people by hooking them into the water with the spear? That's awesome as hell. That's okay, awesome. Man. Oh, hey, Bess. Are you, are you still doing Pike? Yeah, oh, okay. He's he's bald. He's, he's awesome. A shark man with an assassin who just fucking, like, drowns people. spears you. Yeah, drowns them and does a big giant fucking X execute on him. They kill him people. He's a A tier for drowning people. Jason Voorhees yeah. type shit. All right. Did you already do Orin, the big giant ram that can create weapons? The fluffy and mustache fire. man. Yeah. He's cool. I really don't know jack shit about Kiana, the next lady. I only know is she has a big giant like razor circle that she attacks people with, like a big giant razor circle hula hoop. I know someone named Kiana. And she that's can do something. And she like does stuff with elements. I don't know. I've never played as her, and I've had no desire to learn anything about her. All I know is she does, does element stuff, and she has a big giant razor hula hoop. The hula hoop thing sounds pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Um... But you're not interested in her, and you're like, you know a good chunk about almost all these fuckers, so that's a, that says a lot. She's not my thing. She has an e she, she's an ego queen. I thought you were gonna say she has an oh. eating disorder for a second. I don't know, all I know is she's like Latina or some shit. The bottom of C, I don't know. She kinda looks cool. Eh, let's see. This guy looks like almost like the male version of her, That's except boring. boring. She has a big giant like a girl? eagle thing. Oh yeah. yeah. She 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 attacks with like like a little like spear launcher gun from like her wrist or whatever. And she has a big giant eagle that like carries her around so she can fly around with a big giant bird. That's cool. And then when she gets off the bird, a like a little freaking thousand arrows things falls down from the sky on people when she like gets off her bird all right i was gonna put her d but that bird thing sounds cool so i'll put her middle of c underneath alien guy uh this guy looks smug as fuck for having That's elf Rakan. ears he's like a bird man hybrid thing and he's in love with Zaya. And Have I done Zaya his yet? Whole life. No, you're, she's like okay. one of the last ones. Okay. And he's like her. He like protects her and stuff. His whole like thing is like around protecting her and stuff. Oh wait, is it going like alphabetical? Yeah. Okay, I wasn't really paying attention. I I could tell. Yeah, I could tell because I'm like, yeah. His whole thing like he protects Zaya, and like he's like a bird man hybrid thing. Top of F. Turtle man. Or snake. I don't know. The helmet looks like a turtle, but he could be a snake. There's, they're, they're basically married. Yeah, that he's, he is literally a big giant turtle with a really spiky shell, who just attacks you with his big spiky shell. He's a Koopa. And he, can, he can spin really, really, really fast and move very, really, really, really fast when he's spinning around on his with his shell. Okay. His big giant spiky shell. He's a Bowser. And, he, and when people attack him, they take damage from attacking his spiky shell. That's awesome. I should play. Him. Turtle man who says okay. Okay, that's fucking. That's A tier material right there. I don't know if he could be S, but he'll definitely stick somewhere in A. I don't think he's as cool as I'm gonna drown your dumb ass, but he's cool. This guy is all fucking teeth. Call this man the Tooth Fairy. He has teeth is and is blue and purple. That's Rek'Sai. She's a she's like a void creature thing who can like create tunnels around the map and like can go underground. And see, like, footsteps through, like, ripples under the ground. She, like, goes underground, literally. Alright, she's and a creates, mole. like, portals underground. And she's, like, a little monster. Basically, she, like, imagine a mole was, like, a monster that can travel under the ground. Alright, I was thinking of C, but that sounds pretty cool. You remind me of all the losers in the Ant arc in Hunter x Hunter, the weakest arc in the show, so that makes me not like you. You'll go B. I'll keep you in B. You look kind of cool. Um, this lady has eyebrow piercings or something. That's Rel. She's basically she rides like this metal horse thing, and that metal horse thing can turn into like these big giant leg armor that's really heavy, but makes her really beefy and strong and shit. That sounds awesome. And she like like you know how like medieval times they'd ride horses and like oh she's another lesbian. I did not know she was lesbian. There's a lot of lesbians in this game. I need to start uh, playing it. Uh, you know how like they charge at each other with those big giant long sticks? They joust. 
Like, like a, yeah, I guess, yeah. yeah. It's like that, but like more pointy and bigger. She uses that. But she rides this big, giant iron, like, horse thing, which can turn into armor that she can wear on her legs. That sounds awesome as hell. And very, uh... I don't know what the word is. Uh, proactive or whatever. I don't know. Go and be. Right? Like making gay characters or change the lore to make the character gay. Nah, that's true. We stand. Um, As of late. Bro with that's, the mask. That's... She uh, is a girl? Uh, Renata. Renata. Se she seems like another She's emperor She's an old type. lady who's like just a general who uses this big giant like lamp thing as like her source of power or whatever or something. I don't really fucking remember what she does. All I know is she shoots with a, like a fucking pistol gun and uses that shit. She can make all the enemies attack their teammates, which is really fucking cool. Like, she can make the other team kill them, kill each other. Okay, cool. that was gonna be D tier, but that last part saves her so bottom of C. Okay, this is a fucking alligator or crocodile. Oh, uh, Renekton. Oh, this guy's cool. He uses a big giant, like, fan... So, like what is a fan sword called? The word it's like a semicircle, but it's like oh, I know knife. what you're talking about. Yeah, I don't know what it's called, but I know that, what you're talking about. And he builds up rage and can transform into a big giant fucking alligator thing. Hell yeah! Like, Beat your ass. Big Plus points for being big an alligator. Giant, semicircle. Anything that's like a big giant insert animal here is probably gonna be above D tier. Well, that's the same thing with Nasty. He's a big giant. He can turn into a big giant fucking dog thing. I'll say bottom of B. Okay, this, whoa, what are you? You're a werewolf thing, maybe? With a blue eye and a gold eye. That's, a, he's a tiger. Tiger. That's, that's, uh, fucking Rengar. Rengar. And he hunts people, and then once he hunts them, he gets stronger and shit. Seems kind of like, simple, he's like, he's but like cool. A, he's like a, literally, he's like king of the jungle type shit. He's like a tiger that, like, hunts and kills and assassinates shit really, really, really fast. Top of C. Seems a little basic, but cool basic. Like, I respect it, but want a little more from you. This guy... I've seen so many people that look like this guy in this fucking game. Big horned motherfucker. That's... Oh, that's Ross. That's, like... No one <laughs> said Kane. Remember His name I is said Ross? That guy's a, it's, it's Ross. Oh, like Ross. R H. Yeah. Oh, okay, I thought it was just uh, Ross. He is the same one as Kane. Who's it's Kane just again? When I, remember when I, like the one with the scythe that I said can either turn into an anime man or turn into a big giant monster when uh, the scythe kills him? Yeah. It's all that guy. That guy's the same guy as the other one. Only that's when the demon takes of the scythe takes over and kills him. I forgot who that guy was. I'm trying to find him. I know yeah, he's, he's in F tier. He's an F? Oh no, no, he's D tier. Right, it's the second to last. Oh, this loser. So he's like him, but he is him. It's just that's what happens if the scythe takes over his body. Oh, that's cool as hell. He should he kill like. him. That's how he should let the scythe take over more. Okay, then do you see? Do you see like the jester clown that's you haven't ranked yet? No, jester. Okay, oh, this guy. This guy. This guy. Like, you're the one right next to it. He's like blue, and has long hair. This guy. This like, is a jester to clown. The right. No, the one next to it. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, the one you had your mouse over. That he's 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 that's what happens if he defeats the demon and the scythe. Oh, so like that's what three of the like. same people. The one the one you ranked first is what he looks like originally, and then you basically just get to pick in game which one you want to use. Red guy is awesome. Blue guy kind of sucks, but he is better than normal guy. Put him top of D. All right, got those guys out of the way. All right, blonde lady. That's Riven. She has to she has to get nerfed because she has to use a broken sword. And she's full she blooded kicks American. Her ass with a broken sword, basically. And she like does like a little combo on you and stuff. Her whole her whole thing is like combos and shit. Bottom with of the, D. She's a broken sword and her alt like fixes the sword and she can like kick your ass with like a big at like a big fucking floating pieces of swords. We got a little rat creature here. That's a, that is a little rat creature. He's like the other, like the fucking Heimerdinger I keep t referring to, the little fucking rat. Yeah, people. he's awesome. He rides in a fucking machine that can like spit fire, throw like spike balls and like spikes and shit at you. He rides in a big machine. Okay. That he controls and he like like a big fucking machine that has like a little spike ball on it. It can breathe fire, like a spray fire, throw it, shoot balls, shoot like a big giant fucking mortar missile, like rectangle out of the sky. Not as cool as riding a lizard, but still up there, so bottom of B. But he can't be a lizard guy. Alright, this guy's old and has a beard and a beard and is bald. <laughs> he 
He's oh, bald. Rise. He has to protect some fucking squirrels or some oh. shit, and he's turned blue. That's and it. Okay. His whole thing is like he uses magic to protect these this fucking book or something. He's Marlin the, the book wizard. Gets in the wrong hands, then fucking the world ends. He protect has a lot the on his plate. Uh, he's f. I don't like him. He's, I just think of him as the fucking Papa Smurf. Eye patch lady. That's Samira. She basically is like a bounty hunter kind of woman assassin thing that uses a gun and like a sword together and can do a bunch of really cool combo things and then like gets up to like an s grade cool combo and can like fucking nuke fucking everybody points for being bad she's like hunter. latina with she lost her eye or whatever she has character and is a bounty hunter c tier uh dude with blue helmet or something <laughs> blonde hair Oh, that's, that's that's stage Wani. She rides a big giant like, what is it? I don't know if stars. A here. polar bear. Or, what does she ride? I mean, kind of. It's white and really furry. Is is it like a pig? <laughs> a, it's a big poro. I don't know. It's like a big poro who like likes to kill things. Uh, it's like a what big the hell is giant a poro. White, it's a big giant white thing with tusks. And, like. Just imagine a polar bear with. Oh tusks. my god, this thing is so funny looking. Not, I love it. Little one. Sid, Sid. Oh, I like the Poro. Because this is what I'm getting for Poro. This little fucker right here. This guy is fucking awesome. I like Poro. Uh, Mighty Poro. It's not, it's, not, it's not that one. It's. Images. Oh, I guess I guess it is. It's just a really, really big one of those things. Who wants a oh wait, no, it's not. Yeah, what the fuck? It's not, not that. Imagine that, but like turns scary. Awesome. It has tusks. That's not what it looks like. Don't care. I already have the image in my head. That's a fucking A tier. Lots of skin. More yeah. poros, chat. More poros. All right, this. Person with the green eyes and has a hood. That's Senna. That's the one I was talking about earlier. Oh my god, like Senna the, the streamer? Lucian, no the shot. one with two sh two guns. Senna's the one with the white big giant like sniper gun thing. Cyber's pretty cool. And they fight they fight like demon monster spirit things. <sighs> They're called the Sentinels of Light. I really want to put her in C tier, but someone just tell me to put her in D tier. She just seems kinda like meh. Pink haired lady, Princess Bubblegum. She's like a pop star, music star wannabe who like uses music to attack and use magic music or some shit, and that everyone hates her. Really goofy. I'm putting her A. All right, dude with hair. <laughs> you do not care what people think. I don't give a shit. Fuck them. They play League of Legends. It, they play League of Legends. That's Fuck them. He's like came from poverty, and his dad left him, and he hates his dad, and his he loves his mom. Because his right. mom took care of him as a widowed mom, and he, like, got into, like, boxing and fighting, but, like, underground boxing and fighting for money so he could take care of his mom and his family. And then he turned into one of the best ones, so his whole thing is he just beats people's asses with his knuckles. Father left him F tier. Next. Okay. Uh, no, probably B. Sounds, sounds wholesome, little guy. Alright, this is a clown. This is Harley Quinn's ex-boyfriend. The jester who's mad. He he is he's the most annoying character. Everybody hates his character. He places little like jester boxes that can like that go invisible. You can't see it. If you step in them, you take a fuck ton of damage. <laughs> he can go invisible and just run around like a little doof. He can throw knives at you. He fucking the, if the, if you're not facing him, he does more damage to you as like he stabs you in the back type shit. Uh, he's awful. He could create a clone of himself. And if you kill it, you get fucked. So you have to guess which one's real. He's a fucking nuisance to <laughs> That sounds fucking, fucking awesome. Him. I'm putting him B. That sounds fucking so funny. You know what? Fuck it. I'm putting him A, actually. Nah, B. He's not as cool as Pop Star Lady. Alright, uh, another basic dude wearing a helmet. Please change the look of half your people. Please. They all look so similar. That's Shin. Stupid. He's a ninja who has a big, giant, like, floating sword that he uses. All right. So like, as like abilities and stuff, he can like it's like a big giant glowing blue sword, and he's like a ninja, and he uses like a sword to like, and he can is really beefy and tanky and shit, and he uses that sword to like fucking kick people's asses. 
Like a big giant blue floating sword. He's a fucking ninja. Blue purple ninja guy. D. Alright. Whoever this fucking person is, I don't even know how to describe them. Thanos, if they sucked. That's Shivana. She can turn into a fucking dragon. Uh, she's like a dragon woman, but then eventually she can turn into an actual fucking dragon, like a fully fucking dragon. Pretty cool. Who breathes fireballs and shit. What else can she do? Uh, she breathes fireballs. I don't know what the other two shits do. All I know is she can turn into a giant fucking dragon. I'm gonna put top of C, but put guy that's king of the jungle and hunts people and gets stronger in B. He's growing on me. Another bald person, ew. <laughs> um, with a mask or that's, some. That's singed. He's like he a had no mouth. chemist guy who like runs around with toxins that come out of his back. Like okay. there's a toxin trail behind him. Everyone fucking hates him because he's really fast. You can never catch him. But if you chase him, he'll just kill you slowly. Jeez. And like you're actually killing yourself by trying to kill him because he leaves this toxic trail behind. Throws like this little sticky bomb, like sticky thing that makes you really slow and stuck in the ground, so he can just run around you and poison you to death. And he's really he's bald, sick, gross, and old, and fucking kills you with toxins. And everyone hates him. Toxins coming out of the back is kind of cool. Bottom, bottom of C tier, probably very top of D. Okay, this guy is into some kinky shit. Whoever this guy is. He's got a claw around his fucking neck. Or is that just a bottom row of that's, teeth? That's that's Scion. Basically, it's a big, giant fucking axe. When I say big, I mean massive fucking axe. Uh, he's really fucking big, and he's basically bald. And, and, he, and anytime he dies, he actually comes right back to life and starts beating your ass. Like, if right. you kill him in-game, he comes back to life with, like, he drops the axe, and he just starts beating your ass with his bare hands. Hell yeah. He's basically undead, kinda. But, like, undead, like, actually, like, alive, undead, not just, like, the undead like the other fuckers. We'll see. Sounds pretty cool. Uh, okay, we're, we're almost at the end. Good lord. Uh, lady with an emerald on her head. Sivir, she attacks you with, like, a circle thing. It's like a sharp circle. She throws, like, oh no, no, she throws, like, a boomerang, but it's, like, a quad so she's boomerang. Australian. So like a plus. She throws, a, like, a plus boomerang. Like, imagine that, like, a like a circle. No, it's not a circle. It's, like, it's a plus. She throws pluses at you, but really sharp pluses. I plus got signs. you. And she, like, just throws them shits at you. But she's not Australian? She's more like... From desert. So I guess maybe. She's like from desert. Seems a little lame, but she could be Australian, so C. Uh, this fucking monster looks like the zombies from Fortnite. This guy got teeth and yellow eyeballs. He's like a scorpion. Gem, a gem scorpion. Oh, okay. I like that. Shit, my test grade came in. Give me a second. He passed with a 96. Chat. Everybody clap for best. Who passed with a 96. Gem Scorpion sounds cool. Description alone, I like it. I like it. I fear he might be a little on the basic side, but... For now, bottom of B, he might move up or down depending on if I ever learn more about him. Hmm... All right, next up is a blue-haired woman. Let's freaking go. Um, she seems really, really basic. That's Soda. She, like, attacks with, like, musical, like, harp. Not a harp, like a piano. She throws she, like, pianos has, on like, people? Yeah, she plays music for people. Oh. She can enhance her team or, like, heal them with music. So, and like, a lamer version of like, Pop Star Lady? Yeah, well, she's the original form of pop star lady like she's basically like the classical version uh lame d top of d purple lady that's who that's who blips plays when he plays lady. piano lady he, he played that yeah he played sona dude what a loser 
a purple lady with bleach blonde hair and yellow eyeballs. With I want to say that's either a crown or a horn coming out of her that's head. That's Soraka. She, yeah, she does have a big giant horn that comes out She's of her head. She's a unicorn. She, she basically takes life out of herself to give it to her teammates to heal them. Damn, if you were going to say take life out of people, that'd be cool. She basically she... sacrifices herself to heal her teammates, basically. <sighs> that's noble and I kind of respect it, I guess. But taking life out of her enemies would have been a cooler bar to drop. Um, bottom of C. I can't, I can't put her higher. This guy looks... Wait, you already did Pantheon? Who's Pantheon? He's in D tier. Uh, he's right under Sona, the one, the one that the ship lips lays is a D tier. He's the, he's the one with the helmet. Oh, this guy, yeah, he's a loser. He's fucking cool as fuck. No, he looks he's basic. The character in the game. Well, you weren't here to describe him. Star was one to describe him. He said he fights gods. I was like, oh, that's it. He doesn't look like he fights gods. He looks like he fights little so gremlins a human, in a dungeon. He's a human who is basically like the gods have wronged us for the last time. So I'm gonna fight the gods who think they're so much better than us and he fights fucking like gods and demons and shit as just a regular fucking human and all he has is a spear and he could fucking like climbs up like the highest peak of the like the world just to like fucking yell at the gods and then they like sent the fucking they sent something to spite him and kill him and he killed it he like took over he like killed the god so then he's like a god he's like so he earned the right to be a god but he said fuck you i'm not being a god y'all are terrible and so he's like a man. He's like the god of man, men. But like he's a, just a regular man. Alright, now that I have more context, is he won't be mid D tier. He'll be top of D tier. He's basically like a Spartan man. Basically, like kind of look like with a big giant spear and a big shield. Professor at Hogwarts. That's Swain. He's basically the ruler of a whole nation and uses crows to like. Whoa. Uh steal the life force out of people and there like, we go he can, like put his giant eye down and if it hits you he like steals crows like basically he turns your soul into crows and steals it for himself and makes himself stronger through it all right if if that power belonged to the purple lady with the unicorn horn she'd be a tier this guy looks stupid but his power's cool so i i, I he feel has like... a big giant metal black metal armor and like uses crows <sighs> that's cool as hell that i really like purple lady more but I gotta put this guy higher. I don't know. Maybe like bottom of B tier. Ham, the, the basic Swain and Pantheon are my two favorite characters in the whole game. Have okay, we done Swain yet? You're ranking just now. Yeah, the oh. character you're ranking right now. All right, well, at least one of your favorites. And the favorites character got I made high. the whole, and then the, the one I was making a case for. He's my favorite character. Oh yeah, he, he can't go higher than D. Pantheon, Swain, and then it goes Kane. What about Fiddle Sticks? I don't like Fiddle Sticks. Fuck very you! Much. I hate you! I hate you! I hate. All right, moving on. We got this guy who looks again basic human dude, but my eyes glow, so I'm special. Shut up. That's Silas. He basically could steal other people's ultimates and shit, and he ha he basically. Well, Star was like, that one character is the only person who can do magic. Magic who isn't in prison. Well, he, this guy was put in prison, but he was so strong he got out. Whoa, he's like and Tai he, Lung from fucking Kung Fu Panda. And he uses the fucking chains that chained him down as weapons now. To condemn those and put him in jail. It's pretty cool. Bottom of C tier. I don't like his look. Another purple glowy eyed lady. With ram horns, I think, maybe. That's Sindra. She uses, like, black hole orbs to, like, kill people with them. He, like, she, like, smacks people with her black hole orbs. So she's like Raven from Teen Titans. In basically, a way. They, they, yeah, basically. That's pretty cool. Bottom of B, I guess. Oh my god, we got a toad with a top hat. Uh, a top top hat. of A -T, A tier. Oh, that's Tom Kent. He's a demon. He looks like a toad. Is he not? He's a catfish. Oh, he's a, oh, even better, Loki. And he has the top hat, top of A tier. I don't know cat, enough cat, about him. Tell me what he does, and he might go an S. He lures people in and then eats them. Holy fuck, that's S tier behavior. Like, all right. like, like sign this contract, and then he's like, all right, you sold your soul to me, I'm gonna eat you. That's fucking, fucking girl boss like, moves right there. The, like, deceives and tricks people. What does this little it? blue guy do? I didn't remember what he does. You can, you can like, summon a big giant fucking shark. He's like, he's from the ocean. He's like short and like fish guy. And like, he's like, he's a big trident. 
And yeah, you can summon a big giant fucking shark. And you can like do a little twirl. I gotta be real. Thinking about it, I love a Moomoo a lot. He's pretty chill, but Catfish with the top hat takes top first place, dude. He's fucking awesome. He's balling. All right, uh, normal person that doesn't belong here with brown hair. That's brown hair. Anybody? That's Talia. She uh, basically she's like Toph from Avatar. She like can control, never saw like, rocks and shit. Oh, she's a rock bender. Yeah, basically she's just a big fucking she's just a rock bender who's a teenage girl. You have momentum, but I'm not a fan. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, put you top of D tier, but not. I gotta I gotta see some growth. Dude wearing a hood who wants to be Assassin's Creed Montgomery. What does he do? That's Talon. He is an assassin. Basically, he throws fucking knives and daggers and shit at you and just like assassinates you really fast. So he's trickster you know, like, from Dead by Daylight. Eh, but... eh. Not really, but he's cooler than Trickster. I'll give him that. Bottom of C. If I hear one person is an assassin, if they don't look cool, they're going F. All right, this fucking handsome son of a god, raw hair. That's Tarek. Yeah, his little stick is being beautiful. He kind of <laughs> just like. He's just like a support character who like helps his team and she can like heal his teammates. He can fucking make them immune to dying. He just kind of like smacks people around with his big giant hammer. He looks like Stan from American Dad with long hair. Um. <sighs> he looks really simple, but the fact that his whole thing is like, I'm pretty and I'm handsome as fuck. Well, it's not that his whole thing is just pretty. It's oh. just like his character is like. Oh yeah, he's just a pretty one. Oh, but he's not egotistical about it. No. Oh, top of F tier. You have let me down. Oh my God, is this Timo? Yeah, it's Timo. Fuck Timo. S tier. I love him, but I hate him. What does Timo do again? He plays his mushrooms around. He's a little shitter. He can go invisible. Uh, he uses a little fucking blow dark gun thing. Oh my god, he's a little farmer and a hunter. He's so adorable. All right, moving on. This green oh, guy shit. that has green fire coming out of his face holes. That's Thresh. Basically, remember I said Lucian and Senna fight off, like, the, like, evil spirits and, like, evil and whatnot? This is the evil. He, like, can trap souls and shit. It's, it's Thresh. He can, he's basically, like, trap souls from the undead and, like, whatnot. It's pretty And his cool. lantern. Bottom of B tier for now. I don't know. You're feeling like a C tier, but C tier's packed. No, it should be B tier. All right, this thing with hair and, and and teeth and eyes. That's Tristana. Basically, remember how I said Heimerdinger's like basically the whole race. She's like the same shit as T Bow and Heimerdinger and whatnot, but she's a big giant fucking cannon as a gun. Is that pretty much it for? Her? Yeah, she's basically just using oh, a cannon as a gun. Not as cool. But you're like Teemo and the other, so I got I got respect for you. You're going bottom B. Alright, we're approaching the end. We got this fucking goblin, dude. Gandalf from Legend of Zelda. Or Super Smash That's Bros. Trundle, he's a troll. That's pretty uh, cool. He's like an ice troll who uses a big giant club and smacks you with it and bites you and eats you with his teeth and shit. He's a big giant ice troll. Alright, I was gonna put him C, but he eats people, so B. He, like, bites people and shit. Alright, this guy with the helmet looks mid as hell. What's his story? Uh, that's Trendemir. Basically, he can, like, he, if he presses a button, he just cannot, he straight up just cannot die. Uh, he smacks you with his big giant sword that he drags on the ground like, uh, Pyramid Head. Yes. And he presses a button, he just straight up cannot die, and he just smacks you and shit with his big giant fucking sword. I feel like I'm only blind in one eye, unless there's just something in my eye. Um, lame, F tier, fuck him. Cowboy, man. That's, or maybe he's a swashbuckler. That's, that's Twisted Fate, yeah, he's a swashbuckler, Hell he's yeah, gay, pirate. he's the one, remember how I said the pirate at the beginning was gay with the two shots? Oh, so this is Lil Nas X? No. Oh, there's another Lil Nas X? Well, yeah, but he's not on this list, I don't think. Oh, I, I thought he was a part of the pirate clan. That's, oh, wait, no, you said no. he's like... African descent or something like that. Yeah, he's from like the desert or something. But yeah, this way he like is like he like deals with cards and shit. Okay, okay. Like, like, he looks cool. Like magic and stuff, but he's gay. 
Why you gotta add the but he's gay? What is that supposed to well, mean? I was gonna say Andy's gay. Oh, okay, just... it came out wrong. All right, don't like cancel him, chat. Don't cancel him. Like he's his grades and the fucking trucking thing. All right. Uh, he has what's his like power? Just playing with cards. He like uses cards as like. He like throw card throws cards at people, but they're like sharp and they do damage. Or he can like use a card that like does a fuck ton of damage, or a card that like. Restores his men or whatever, or a card that fucking traps you in place you can't fucking move. He Or he could teleport wherever the fuck he wants to on the map. He could see everywhere on the map and then teleport wherever the fuck he wants to go. Alright, I was saying on top of C, but teleportation's pretty dope. He has a cool look to him. B, no pirate has captured my heart the way that this bearded dude has, so... That pirate remains on top. Oh, we got Twitch, Ratman... Yeah, he's a fucking poison rat that shoots a fucking stupid fucking. Just because bullet. of our little inside joke, F tier. Um, God, <laughs> Jesus Christ himself, I guess, or Zeus maybe. That's your deer. He basically, he's from like the snowy area. He can like, he has like stances where he can turn into a ram, a tiger, a bear, or a turtle. <laughs> And it changes, like, what he can do. He can be really fast. He can, like, be really tanky. He can, like, turn into someone who does a bunch of fucking damage. Or, or, or it's like a... Like, remember that ch ice chicken? Yeah, he's up there. He can, like, use, like, that... He, like, turn, uses that for martial arts form or whatever and can, like, make some aura like, similar to what she can do. I'll say bottom of B, because, like, you list off all those badass animals and he said, and or a turtle. <laughs> I'm like, that's awesome. Uh, bottom of B. Alright, this guy, another bald man with some kind of thing on his face. That's Urgot. He has basically spider legs, metal spider legs instead of legs. And he shoots them off like shotguns. And he can fucking, he like, basically has shotgun spider legs. And, uh, he has a big giant, like, like his stomach is a big giant, like, you know, like how, I don't know how to describe it. Uh, like a saw trap, how it, like, like all the metal stuff, salt, like whatever, come together, and it's like your hands going in, and it's gonna be ripped off. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that, basically, like a saw trap, like that. Yeah, that's his like, ed like his fucking stomach, and he could like shoot you with a spear and then drag you into it and kill you like that. All right, he's pretty cool. I got it. I wasn't digging him, but the more you talk, the more I'm like, all right, he, he he's pretty cool, I guess. I mean, you know, he you know he's killing people, I guess. You know, I got emerald head. Or ruby head, my bad. That's Varus. Basically, these two guys fell into like this pit or whatever. They got fused together, and they turned to like this demon archer man, who can like shoot really, 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 really long arrows, really, really fucking far, piercing arrows. And I know like, a demon and two people fused together. Like if a demon and two guys got fused together, that's what he is. Bottom of the D tier. The demon part saves him from F. Alright, lady with sunglasses. Okay. Fucking hell. Uh, shit. With the vein. She basically shoots little fucking dagger darts from her, her arm. Oh, this is hella trickster. a bunch of fucking, uh, there's a bunch of fucking damage. And then she could, she like, if someone's running away from her, she can like, she runs faster. She's kind of basic as fuck, but... Well, her little stick in the game is she does a bunch of fucking true damage. F tier. Don't like her. Uh, I thought this was a box of fucking pizza for a second. That's Vagar. He's a little shitter who gets mad when everyone <laughs> makes fun of him because he looks stupid as fuck. Aww. But he wants to be evil, but no one think takes him seriously because he looks stupid. Hell yeah, A tier. He's cute and shit. But he's like, no, I'm evil. I'm evil. I'm evil. A tier. Perfect character. Okay, this is the fucking- this is Reyna's ult from fucking Valorant. That's Velcaws, and he's just a fucking floating eye with, like, three tentacles. That's dope. But it reminds me of Valorant, so and instead of A, I'm gonna put you B. Laser beams. That's... Like a big, giant, purple laser beam. All you gotta do is have an interesting look in the game, and I'll give you credit. But if you remind me of Valorant, then I piss my pants and soil myself, so... <laughs> All right, we got blue hair. Use your pants and soil yourself. <laughs> we got blue hair, pink eyes. She That's looks like she doesn't want to be there. She's, yeah, she just she does it. She's like depresso expresso. Okay, this is hot topic worker again. And her shadow can like 
Hawk, like her shadow is like I think it's like a demon. Maybe it's not a demon. It's just like another being. It's like her shadow. And it's like she's like TMO and Heimerdinger, like Tristan. She's like one of those things, but she's like depressed and like has a shadow that she could talk to or whatnot. Makes has no friends. I can't like, fucks with you sad. if you're depressed, but also the same like breed and stuff as Timo and them. You gotta be cheerful and cool. Sorry, lady, but uh, you're going. Wait, she has a shadow that's a demon that she can talk to. Yeah, that's cool. B tier. I'll give you benefit of the doubt right there. All right, we got guy mewing. With blue eyes. That's Viego. Remember that doll I said that came to life? Yes. He made that doll come to life. Wow. He's basically... What is he? Blade of the Ruin. He's the Ruin King. Uh, Basically, remember how I said there's like all those undead people? Like the horse, the person with the spear. Yeah. The, he's the leader uh, of all of them? Yeah, he's, he's their king. Ah, boo. How can all these like undead people be so kind of cool and Doll Lady be kind of cool? But he's so fucking stupid. He, he's he's like he, he's looking for his long lost wife who got killed, and so he's like doing all this stuff to try to find her. Find her? Oh, to bring her back to life. Uh, I was yeah. like, bro, she's dead. Give it up. But I'm like, oh, okay. So basically, remember I said the Sentinels of Light? They're mm -hmm. fighting basically Viego. All right. This guy. I was he's gonna a put him D. Sword. You know that sword in Valorant that I have, like the really big I one. I think so. That's that's his sword basically. Oh. Only in Valorant, it's a lot smaller Easter than it actually is in game. All right, he's on a mission and it builds character. I was gonna put him like bottom of D, but uh, bottom of C. Who the fuck are you, dude? You got like a, I don't know what the fuck. I don't even know how to describe you. You got more metal that's on your Victor. face. He's Russian, of course. Uh, and he has a bunch of cool machines, and he's. Obsessed with evolution, so his like abilities and shit evolve over time, and like he gets stronger and stronger and shit as the game goes on and he gets shit. But he's like a oh, shit obsessed with evolution. D tier. I don't like people that are obsessed with stupid things. Like an engineer obsessed with evolution. This lady looks cool. She got goggles on her head. She's giving me that's like vibe. That's Mad the top Max That lady I said was a lesbian and had the long sniper. Uh huh. This is who goes with her. So she goes with top hat lady. Yeah, she goes with top hat Space. lady. She has big giant robot hands. Okay, I thought you were going somewhere else with that. Uh, yeah, that she punches people with. She's like a badass who punches people with a big giant robot hands. Let's fucking go. We love couples who slay together. Poggers. Because Top Hat Lady was awesome. And now I'm glad her partner is same league. I'll put her in A. Not next to her. But uh, just an A in general. Wow, we got this guy who has hair and has a sword. And Vi and Jinx are sisters. Vi is coming up later, I'm assuming. Vi is the one you just did. Oh, what? So we're already at the V's, bro? What the fuck? Yeah, this is Vladimir. He's basically a blood uh, vampire Vladimir. guy. Vladimir. Like, to use, like, blood Oh, vampire. wait, Jinx's sisters with pink-haired lady? Yeah, Vi. Oh, shit, and they're all in the same tier. Good for them. All right, this guy looks stupid. What's his story again? He's, like, a blood-sucking vampire who, like, sucks the blood out of you and, like, uses it for himself and heals himself with your blood. That's pretty base. I'll go like, Vladimir the Vampire basically yeah that's cool as hell nice name nice alliteration top of c for alliteration uh polar bear man he's cool he's that's going in a but tell me his yeah, story yeah he's like he's lightning ice vo vo polar bear he's, like, right. he's a god who is basically he, he's like the thunder god who can who's he's like from thor ice place and he's a big fucking polar bear i like that that's a tier material right there oh my god we got a wolf of wall street what's his story warwick he basically, the lore says, or what is it, the conspiracy is this character, you know Vi and Jinx? Yes. Their actual parents died, and they were adopted by Warwick before he got turned into a werewolf. And they think that the basically their adopted dad got transformed into this character. Mm hmm Through, like, do you remember Singe, the character with poison or whatever? I said was on his bald, back. That was bald. Yeah. Yeah. He basically, they think he turned their adoptive dad into this werewolf what guy. What a bitch. And so basically, he's a big giant werewolf who can like smell your blood and shit and come and kill you and whatnot. 
Alright, I'll put a mix of Vladimir the Vampire. Damn, we gotta watch Arcane, bro. Is all the shit in Arcane or no? Yeah. Okay, yeah. good. A lot of these characters you like more because of Arcane. How many of all these are in Arcane? Like, pretty much all of them? Or, uh, like, half? Vi, Jinx, Caitlyn, Warwick, Victor, uh, Jace. Are any of the people in S tier in the show? Heimerdinger is. Nobody else? Timo's not there? Uh, no. Fiddlesticks is not there? No. Catfish ain't there? No. Bro, fuck that show sucks ass. Fuck it. No, I'm not watching. I was gonna one. ask you to watch you, but... It has one in S tier. One, two, three. I think, okay. Three, I only saw three, but three from A tier. I'm so That's, disappointed. Okay. Next one's Wukong. I'm so disappointed. I was you know, really you know looking what, forward to watching that show. You know Wukong? From it's Fortnite. Like Wukong from Buddhist and whatnot. Oh, sure. It's the, basically the same looking guy with a big fucking staff. Just waxy with his staff and is a monkey. All right, points for being monkey, but other than that, kind of, it's chilling. I get. Oh, let's see. All right, lady with red hair and a hood. That's that's Zaya. Remember the uh, the bird guy? I said. Yeah. Was in love with the bird lady. This is the bird lady. She shoots fucking feathers at you. And she the smug bitch it, down here. Because he was uh, the one that was an F tier. She's yeah, already cooler he, than him. Like they're, they're like lovers or whatnot. Uh, but she throws, she like shoots you with feathers, and then she can retract the feathers, and they can stab you again. Uh, that's cool, but she likes the other guy, and that other guy sucks. So they're lovers. D tier for loving on that weirdo. All right, uh, whatever the fuck this thing is, an orca whale with the chain. That's Zerath. Basically, he's like chained up energy and like mass and shit and whatever, who can like launch giant orb balls from fucking himself all across the fucking map and he can like do really really long range energy attacks and shit and he's basically just a big energy mass thing it's like chained together damn forced to be a prisoner must suck um i don't know b tier he looks really unique good for him this guy also looks like he's just he was born and he's had what to I fight found people. is the more unique the characters look the harder they are to play man that sucks uh, that's Xin Xiao. He's basically a guy who fights with a big, giant, long spear thing. And he's basically just a warrior guy who fights with a big, giant spear. Ah. Uh, big, really long, giant spear thing. F tier under pretty boy. Too basic. Alright, this guy, not looking good for him. He better have a good ability. He looks basic Yas well. Yasuo, basically, he killed his brother, or is the reason his brother died. Oh. Um... And he forever feels shame for it, and it basically is like exiled from society, like the society he was in, because society knows what happened to him, so he's always looked society. down upon. And he's a master with his sword, and he could create like he could create tornadoes as well with like his sword and like wind and shit. Mm -hmm. And so basically, he can like create wind tornadoes through his sword. He's like a master swordsman and shit, and he like feels regret for killing his brother. I was gonna put him F tier, but he killed his brother, so that's kind of funny. D tier. All right. Um. Speaking of the brother, he Gundam. killed the next character Gundam is man. Yone, and he Yone is the brother killed. that got killed by his brother L. because he, because his younger brother, who was Yasuo, was reckless and whatnot, and he was trying to teach him a lesson, but then his brother ended up killing him on accident. But then he came back to life through this like demon mask thing, and now he uses two swords and. Yasuo can like create like a tornado where uh, Yone creates like a tsunami esque thing where it just knocks you up. And he's just, he can like create like an unchained like pair, like soul thing where he can like be at one spot and another spot at the same time and like attack you and whatnot. And basically, he like came back to like tell his brother he's forgiven and whatnot and that it's like he's okay and whatnot. Dude, you should pull a swerve of me like, I don't forgive you, I fucking hate you. Yeah, that's uh, basically his older brother, D -tier. who's a lot infinitely more mature than he is. D tier because he got killed by his brother. That's funny. Oh wait, there's a kitty cat coming up. All right, a uh, pirate yeah, man yeah, with a okay. hood. That's Yorick. Basically, he could summon a maiden and like resurrect the dead. Kind is of. Is he a pirate? But like in the form of no, he's like a Aww. like a like a like a like a like a funeral like. What what a graveyard warden type thing? Oh, I got you. Yeah, Where you yeah, can yeah. like raise them as the dead as little gremlin things that go and attack you. You can send like little gremlins to attack you and like summon a big giant maiden spirit things 
thing pretty cool. like attacks you, and he has a big giant fucking shovel. That's so pretty he smacks cool. you around with. Pretty cool. I'm gonna put this guy. He can raise people from the dead. B tier. All right, kitty cat. It's a kitty. It's literally just a cat that rides on a book. All right, S tier. Little green oogie boogie. It because it's just a parasite that attacks attaches to a character and can do absolutely jack shit. Nothing. This is oogie boogie from. That's just Nightmare imagine just a big Christmas. giant fucking slime, and that's what this character is. All right, A tier. Big giant green slime. That's awesome. I should put him in S, but no. Um, this thing with hair, but That's it's also it. a knight. He's a ninja assassin thing. Oh, he he's an like assassin. F tier. With shurikens and create like shadow forms of himself. Okay, that's kind of cool. And like, like tricky with where where exactly he is or where he isn't, and he uses shurikens and like to assassinate or whatever. He's like a ninja ninja assassin that uses shadows and shit to fuck you up. That sounds pretty cool. He'd go top of D, but I said the next assassin would go F, so he's top of F. Green-haired lady. That's, you know, Neon? From Valorant? Yeah, imagine Neon, but yellow with a gun that does, like, burst shit. And, like... I, can't, I don't, yeah. Same voice actor, same character design and everything. It's just she's yellow. Ye ye she looks like just yellow neon, but she, like, uses, like, a burst gun. She uses electricity still, and she can, like, slide across walls. Pretty cool. And she's not from Valorant. So put her be, because I like Neon from Valorant, but uh, Valorant sucks, so. Yeah, uh, same voice actor, same character design and everything. I'll put her be. Alright, this thing with goggles on and teeth. A lot of teeth. Uh, that's Ziggs. He throws bombs. I like he's his like, name. He's like Timo, Kled... Heimerdinger, all them, but he's just... Is he evil, he's, he's Timo? Crazy. He's basically just psychotic, crazy guy who throws bombs. Fuck yeah. And giggles and laughs a lot. A tier. That's A tier. Z evil yeah, Timo isn't play. real. Evil Timo can't hurt you. Evil Timo. Alright, anyways. Down to three, we got fucking Ragnarok from Fortnite. What's he doing here? He's got hair and a beard and blue that is, eyes. That's Zillion. Basically, he can he's like time related kind of too. Okay. Basically, he can like place his thing on you, and if you die, you get resurrected. Basically, okay. he's like like Santa Claus with a big giant clock on his back. Ooh, Father like Time. Float. Basically, yeah, I guess. Raise people from the dead. That gimmick's already been taken. Sorry, buddy. Um, where did I put raising people from the dead guy? I put him somewhere. Oh, I put him up here in B. So this guy will go in. This guy will go in C. Damn, C is packed full of people. All right, we got two more. This is Taylor Swift, but in League of Legends. All right, we stand That's Taylor Zoe. Swift. She's like a cosmic galaxy little kid that okay. everyone fucking hates. Ah. Because her character is insufferable. Aww. She like throws little bubbles that put you to sleep. <laughs> or she like. What's her ult? I don't even know. Where's her ult? Oh, she can, like, zip to another place. The bubble thing is cool. Really, just the bubble thing that they're kind of carrying her. I'm going to put her B. All right, and the last person, don't tell me their name. They start with a Z. I'm going to try to guess their name. What is the second letter of their name? What? What's the second letter of the last person's name? I want to try to guess their name. Why? Oh shit, so Zy something? Fuck. Um, Alright, this is Zylot. Zyra? Fuck, close. Not really. She's like... Imagine... What's her fucking name? What's the person from DC that does plants? Poison Ivy? Oh, cool. Poison Ivy, but she summons plants through her abilities, and they just start fucking attacking people. Or she can summon, like, a big giant fucking, like, circle of plants who start fucking your shit up. <laughs> yeah. Right, she was but gonna she's, go not, and she's less like sedu like seduce you or more just, like, like just try to kill straight you. to the point poison ivy yeah uh, yeah all right I was gonna put her C but when you brought up the term fuck your shit up that made me laugh so she's going B all right and there we go there's League of Legends characters based on well it was gonna be vibes but also based on description and a little lore and whatnot 
Uh, I think any League player would take a look at this and be like, that's pretty base, Nick. Good job. And I'd say thank you. Get away from me. You play League of Legends. <laughs> yeah, number one League of Legends hater over here. Not really. With some of the explanations and lore, I wouldn't mind giving... I hate the game, but the people in it seem somewhat interesting for the most part. I would watch Arcane if Catfish Man was in it, but since he's not... There's Caitlyn. There's Jinx. Who's Caitlyn? The top hat lady. Hmm. Wait, is, uh... Fuck. Who's someone cool that... Alright, this will make or break whether I watch the show or not. Is... Is... Is this, like, purple alien guy in there? The one with the green eye? The bug? This thing, yeah. The assassin bug? Yeah. No, the assassin bug is not in there. Alright, then I'm not watching this shit. What about the cat that writes on the book? Is the cat in the show? No. Fuck! Basically, Arcane sounds like, like a any bummer, the, bro. Any of the characters that look like they do drugs, they're, they're the ones who'd be in it. I mean, fucking Timo is not in it, and he definitely does drugs. I mean, shit, you do a tale based on characters who think do drugs. Yeah, let's start it over!